Hi there, friends. Our friends at Now the Inn Begins have come up with another news flash, and again, I thoroughly recommend that you go to their site, get their updates, get their emails, because it is an excellent site to subscribe to. They really do come up with the news. So, this is from Now the Inn Begins with my own few comments thrown in. Prepare yourself. They are now building a system that will use smart cameras to force you to wear a mask and observe social distancing. Now, as far-fetched as it may seem, at least three companies are now racing to build a surveillance system that could make this scenario possible very, very soon. And by combining conventional security cameras with artificial intelligence, they hope to identify where people are getting too close to one another or not even wearing a mask. So imagine pulling up to a supermarket and seeing a big red number on a digital sign outside. Instead of enticing you to come inside with sale prices or specials, this sign is giving a number and is estimating the amount of distance between people inside and suggesting that you should stay away until the store is less crowded. Now there's an old expression that talks about the fog coming in on little cat's feet, which is to say it came in slowly and stealthily. You never really saw the fog coming, but all of a sudden it was right there in front of you. That's precisely how the New World Order is bringing in the full-time, always-on human monitoring system. Slowly, certainly, and stealthily. You know, it's just like the man who boiled a frog very slowly heating up the pot so the frog didn't even notice and before long Mr. Frog, before he knew it, was cooked. It's just as President George H.W. Bush said in 1991. He said, The world can therefore seize the opportunity to fulfil the long-held promise of a new world order where diverse nations are drawn together in common cause to achieve the universal aspirations of mankind. Well, really, the universal aspirations of the demonic and the elite. What you are seeing now is the Great Reset that you've been warned about in every decade since the end of World War II. Many believe it has now arrived, and this is what it is beginning to look like. It is the Great Reset Plan revealed, and how COVID-19 may just be the needed force to usher in the New World Order. You know, for months we've seen our way of life change dramatically, and we've been told time and time again things will never be the same, and we must accept the new normal. Now the social engineers have revealed their hand and they have officially launched their solution to the crisis. The proposed solution is the Great Reset. Reset the global economy and then bring in either before that or just after cameras to monitor your behaviour and perhaps even your temperature and your ID and don't think a mask will hide who you are. They've got that covered too. The cameras are so technologically advanced they can digitally reveal what you actually look like beneath the mask. A kind of you can run but you certainly can't hide. In these days, my friend, I want to tell you there is still time to turn to Jesus Christ. The Bible predicted these times and these times are due to happen right before Jesus Christ returns in power from heaven as the rise of the Antichrist comes. My friends, you are living in those times and it is time to turn to Jesus Christ while you are able, before what the Bible calls the great delusion, the great lie, comes into force. It will be so demonically driven, so persuasive, 
it will seem so right to those who are not awake to the lies, and they will be fooled. And those who are awake will become enemies of the new normal, enemies of the state, enemies of the new world order.